I want to automate so that every time a new video is posted on my channel, it automatically tweets the new YouTube video and then maybe it sends it to LinkedIn too. So let's craft kind of how this tweet or post is gonna look on both platforms. So let's go and grab my latest video. I'm in the channel dashboard, let's click edit here. I'm gonna grab this video link and let's see what happens if I just post the link. I'm gonna hit post. Does it show the video? Yeah, it does show the video and it shows the title. Okay, let's delete that. I think I still want to make the title. So let's go, let's paste this here. Let's space this down. Let's copy this title. Let's paste it in. And then I want to finish it with three hashtags. So let's go like hashtag Dolly3, hashtag infographics, hashtag AI tools. AI tools, maybe space this out a bit like this. Okay, that's a pretty good tweet. I don't know how it's going to look on mobile. I hope these line breaks are okay. Maybe because these are two hyperlinks, we're gonna do this. Is that a bit better? No, that looks spammy. Let's, let's go back to how it was. Maybe this. Yeah, that looks better. Okay, there we go. That's our crafted tweet. Let's post this. Okay, this is how we want our posts to look. That's perfect. I like that. Awesome. So that's how it's going to look on Twitter and LinkedIn. So I was thinking about how to automate this process. And I think the best idea is Pabli because Pabli has, let's go to Pabli.com. Pabli has a YouTube video listener. So I'm going to log into my account. All right, we're going to create a new workflow and let's call this auto post to Twitter and LinkedIn. Hit create. Okay, first we need an application trigger. And what I like about Pabli is it's free. So your your trigger, your webhook is gonna be free. It's not gonna cost you anything. So let's search for YouTube. Perfect, trigger event. We're gonna have to do, let's scroll down here. Let's see what we got. New video and channel. Yeah, that's perfect. So new video and channel with video URL. That's the one we want. And click that. And we're gonna connect to my YouTube channel. And I already have a connection to my account and click save. And that's the channel ID. It's the West Frank. This is the channel you're watching now. And let's save and send a test request to see what we get back. See if it grabs that newest video. And I'm scrolling down here and it's perfect. Look at this, the title, crazy new AI breakthrough. That's the exact video we just got. So this is it. This is everything I need. We got the URL, the embed URL, and we have the title and we have even the description. Oh, do we have the description? We don't seem to have the description. It looks like it's repeating just the title there, but I don't think that's a big deal because I'm not gonna be writing that. So let's scroll down here. Oh, sorry, let's scroll up. We're gonna click save. Awesome, successfully saved and let's close this. Okay, the next event. Once a new YouTube video is on a channel, we are going to post to Twitter. But first, we need to craft the tweet because it's going to be different each time. So let's go to here. And for this, let's use chat GPT. And the action event that we're looking for is ask chat GPT. So let's connect to our open AI account. I already have this connection. I'm going to click save. And now we need to select our model. I like that it's GPT-4, it's the best model there. And now in the prompt, what do we need to write in the prompt? We are going to write, create a post about a new YouTube video with the title. And now we're gonna grab some data from the previous step. We're gonna go here and we're gonna grab the title, which is this right here. That's it, period. And I wanna tell it what format I want it in. So I'm gonna say example format of the post and let's do this let's space this out a bit and let's go back to twitter and we're going to grab this because this is exactly what we wanted so it's going to be the title going back we're going to get three hashtags and then the final part is it's going to be the youtube video url so Let's add that in there here. Embed URL, we're gonna grab this. Uh, let's just grab the video URL right here, watch. And I think I wanna add that we want some hashtags just to confirm, create a post when you do with the title. This, make sure to add three relevant hashtags. And I'm gonna go example form of the post. So it looks like the only thing that is going to be AI auto-generated is the hashtags from ChatGPT. This is gonna be the same each time. And then obviously the auto posting is gonna be done through Pabli. So there's a few bit of automations here, but that is the big one with hashtags. So that is it for our chat GPT prompt. 
Now let's save and send a test request to see what happens. Here we go, let's send. Okay, let's see what it spit out. Check out the jaw dropping technology. Can I make this larger? I'm just gonna copy this to see how that looks in Twitter. No, so that is not what we want. So let's go and regenerate here. Let's go and change this prompt. I guess rethinking about the prompt, I don't need to write all this stuff. I only need to kind of get the three hashtags and I can just auto generate everything else myself. So I'm gonna delete all of this and I'm just gonna say, give me three relevant hashtags for a video titled, and then we're gonna give that video title here. And then let's try this again. I'm gonna minimize this. Let's save and send a test request. And that's perfect. Look at that. Artificial intelligence, DALI 3 AI breakthrough. Okay, so that's more what we want. I think that's good for the chat GPT. So I'm going to leave it at that. We're gonna save this. Perfect. Minimize it. And now we're gonna go up to here and we're gonna now post to Twitter. That's gonna be our third step. So let's hit that. Let's search for Twitter. Twitter, now it's called X, silly name. Action event, what we're gonna do is we're going to create a tweet and we're gonna connect our Twitter account. So now we gotta connect with X. I don't have a Twitter connection yet, so let's make it here. It wants our client ID and our client secret. I'm gonna go into my Twitter development console and I'm gonna grab that stuff. Okay, here is my client ID. I'm gonna copy that. I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna paste that here. And now I'm gonna regenerate a client secret. So you guys won't see this, but I'm gonna click this button. Okay, now I gotta authorize the app and we're connected. Okay, so now here's the create tweet, the message. And what we wanna say is we wanna copy Let's cancel this. We want to take the title of the video. So I'm going to do this and I'm going to go take our title, which is this, put an enter down, and then we're going to take our hashtags. So this is what we got from the chat GPT prompt. And it's those three hashtags there. And then one final thing is we want to grab the video URL. So we're going to go back to that step one and we're going to grab the video URL. So this seems to be our tweet. This is what we're going to post. We're not quoting anything. So this can be left blank. And then we're not direct messaging anybody. So this could be left blank too. So now let's save and send a test response. And that is our tweet. So if I go over, let's delete this old one. And I'm going to refresh the page to see if it actually tweeted to my account. Beautiful, look at that, 17 seconds ago, the title of the video, three auto-generated hashtags from ChatGPT, and then the link to the YouTube video. So there we go, that is completely set up and working as expected. So I'm gonna save this right here, I'm gonna scroll all the way up, and on the free plan, the trigger's gonna check for new videos every eight hours, and that's perfect because on my channel, I only upload videos every 24 hours. This could even be longer, but there's no option to change it, so I'll just let it do every eight hours. And every day it's gonna grab my video and it's gonna run through this workflow. Okay, but we're not done yet. We want one more step. We also want to post to LinkedIn. So I'm gonna add another step here and I'm gonna search for LinkedIn. Okay, for the action, let's select share an article or URL, the first version. So that's gonna be able to share it from my profile, connect my account. There we go, author is me. Content, okay, same as the tweet. So we're starting with the YouTube video title. Then we're gonna hit enter, and it's gonna be the chat GPT hashtags that it created. Okay, that's awesome there. And then for the article URL, it's gonna be our video URL. Let's zoom in here to click that, boom, that is it. And then it's gonna be public. So let's save and send a test request, and hopefully it works. Okay, it's shared through, so let's go to the LinkedIn profile. Okay, let's scroll down and there it is. Look at that, that's the post, perfect. So we're gonna click into it and here it is. Wonderful, exact same thing. Okay, so to refresh what happened, let's save this and let's scroll up here. When a new video is posted on my West Frank YouTube channel, it's gonna check this every eight hours. What it's going to do is it's gonna ask ChatGPT to write three relevant hashtags about the video. Then it's gonna go over to Twitter and it's gonna create a post that looks like this with the three hashtags. And then finally, it's also gonna to go to LinkedIn and it's gonna share that video with the same three hashtags. So that is an auto posting YouTube AI agent. Absolutely love it. So hope this helps. And that's one more thing that we have automated.